Here, take a look at this. Great, huh? Wow! And I saved the best for last. See this lever? It's for the blast off, my crowning achievement. <laughs> hey, what's that? Ah. This rocket's gonna be the star of the space exhibit the town hall's putting on. When's Moon getting back with my new little brother? They're taking so long. That's right. Yuki's coming today. They should be here any minute now. Mom! Hi, kids. So where is he? Susie, calm down. Children, this is Yuki. Oh, hi, y'all. Oh. Hi. Oh, hi, y'all. As you know, we're paired with the city of Okashito in Japan. And this week, as part of our pairing program, we're welcoming some of the people that live there. Welcome to our home, Yuki. Say, kids, why don't you show our guest your room? And by the way, just remember, he doesn't speak our language very well. Here, you see? Nice, huh? Come on in, Yuki. Come on, don't be scared. This is my part of the room. Don't pay attention to her, Yuki. That's all girl stuff. Oh, look at this. Not bad, huh? Ma, ikedo. Desa ga denainda. Oh, never mind that, Yuki. It's impossible to put that together. You're out of this world, Yuki. World. Papa to mama ni aita yo. Oh, Yuki go home. It's gonna be great having Yuki staying with us for a week. It'll help broaden the children's minds, expose them to a different culture. Dad, mm -hmm. Look, Yuki built this airplane in two minutes. He's from another planet. Little Yuki is exceptionally gifted. What's that mean? Well, he's ahead of other kids his age. He understands things faster. He's the same age as you, but he's in the same class as Susie. Wow, but. It's such a shame that we can't understand a thing he's saying. It's not all that easy to speak a foreign language, you know. When you go to Japan in the Paired Cities program, you'll see what I mean. To, to Japan? Japan? Yuki! <laughs> uh. Yoo-hoo! Mm. Uh, Yuki? Where is he? Oh, Susie, come here. What are you two doing in my office? Hey, Yuki, wait up. Dad, you scared him. I don't want to spend the whole day running after him. I think our friend was trying to get in touch with his parents. No. It's his first day here. We've got to give him time to feel more at home. He'll feel better tomorrow. We'll give his parents a call in a little while. You're right, Elliot. He's an extraterrestrial for sure. Just because you're really smart doesn't mean you're an extraterrestrial. Well, but it's sure you're not one. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. I say he's the same as us. It's just that he's from Japan, and they speak their own language there. I don't know. It seems to me that he misses his planet. I saw a movie like that once where there's an extraterrestrial who keeps saying he wants to go home. Oh, yeah. I saw that one, too. What a great story. What happened? Well, the little boy has some out. They even go off together on a flying bicycle. My bike doesn't fly. In fact, it's got a flat tire. Mm. <laughs> oh. been here
here for three days now, and he's as sad as ever. I think maybe he's a little young to travel so far from home. He misses his parents so much. Don't worry about it. On Saturday, I'm going to take him to the space exhibit. I'm sure he'll love it. I'm not so sure. Anyway, how is your rocket ship going? Is it ready? Just a few little adjustments here and there, and it'll be all done. I'm gonna help you get back home, Yuki. What a magnificent demonstration, Yuki. You can go back to your seat. I can see mathematics is no mystery to you. On the other hand, Max is not nearly as great. You got a terrific zero on your last homework. Hey, you! I don't like little show-offs like you. I'm gonna make you sorry you made me look bad. Leave him alone! Huh? It's only that he's from another country! Yeah, my friend Yuki just so happens to be an extraterrestrial. He could send you whipping off into space. Whoosh! Just like that. Into orbit. You are so mean, Max! Come on, Yuki. Whoa. I'm telling you, that dummy Max isn't just gonna let this go. I'm sure he's gonna try and give Yuki a hard time. I know. We gotta somehow find a way to help him get home. Yeah, and the sooner the better. What's that noise? That's my dad. He's building a rocket ship in there. Huh? A rocket ship! You two wait for me right here! Hey, where are you going? it is. What do you think? I'm really happy. In just three days, Yuki will be back together with his parents. And in two days, I'll have an enormous triumph. Jeremy, all you think about is that rocket ship of yours. Get ready for takeoff. All systems go. Get ready for countdown. Okay, Yuki. I turned on the turbo propulsion. Oh, thanks, Yuki. Bye, Yuki. It's been really great knowing you. I hope you'll write to me when you get back home. You sure this is going to take him back to his planet? Of course. Don't worry about a thing. He's a genius. He knows how to fly a rocket for sure. All right, but take my word for it. A guy who knows how to put together a rocket like that, well, they don't grow on trees. You've always been so modest, darling. That's what I love so much about you. Mm. Ready for countdown. He's gonna be with his parents again. That's what matters most. Five, four, three, two, one, blast off. Can you imagine the looks on their faces when the rocket starts to lift off? Wow, a total triumph. I'm telling you, a triumph. Huh? 
My rocket ship! Home! Yuki, go home! Yuki! Yuki.